can't say I'm Latina, people are like, how? You don't look like J-Lo. You don't look like Sofia. They're not showing us. When you think about popular media that's spoken in Spanish um, or in Latin American channels, almost always they don't look like us. When you look at Univision or you look at Telemundo, you don't really see a lot of Afro-Latino representation on TV in America or in Latin America, and that's a problem. It was really hard for me to identify with, with someone on television because I never saw myself, I never saw women of color who spoke Spanish on TV, besides like Santa Cruz, of course. But it was really hard for me to see like un actor, un actriz in the telenovela and, not, and say, oh my God, that could be me because there was really never someone who, who stood out. I wasn't able to relate growing up, looking in the media and saying, oh my God, I can see myself on a television network. I didn't see myself there. You have to wonder, do they even teach this in school? Do they even say anything? Because for all we know, every Latino we see on TV is the same. <laughs> so is there no wonder that sometimes people in my family may not understand this? Colorism has definitely always been the topic of conversación in my, in my culture. You always hear these stories about bettering the race, mejorando la raza. Don't date someone who has coarse hair, dark skin, big nose, big lips. Date someone who's said it, fino, whatever. It's really sad to think that this is how my community is conditioned to think that this is what is best for us. I have family members who are dark skin, dark as night, who live in the U.S., including my own father, who um, so whole prejudice is against people of African-American descent. I used to be told not to bring home a black girl uh, to date, which I found very interesting because I know what I see when I look in the mirror. I'm pretty black. At least that's what, how I've seen myself. So for me to not bring home a black girl, that says a lot. If you're a black woman and you have a, you know, a Latina background, I want you to embrace both your family, your culture, you have a history. Don't erase that.